We left out of Revelstoke and drove all the way to Truckee, California. It was about 1,100 miles um, and we took about uh, two or three days to get from Revelstoke to, um, actually we went to Reno first, Reno, Nevada. Spent a couple of days in Reno just to catch up on work, that kind of stuff. And then now we drove up the road to Truckee. Um, Truckee is just north of Squaw Valley, which is where we're going to ski next. So we're going to eat some tacos for dinner tonight and um, turn in a little bit early uh, early tonight so that we can get a good rest, get, get a good start for tomorrow. We're just in an RV park tonight um, in Truckee, so all of the campgrounds are closed around, around Squaw, Squaw Valley, so this was the closest place we could find. Avocado, got my salsa, got my cilantro. I think I'm good to go. So we had a good night's rest last night up in Truckee and this morning headed down the road to Squaw Valley. Uh, posted up in the parking lot, cooked some breakfast, egg sandwiches, what was it, eggs and bagels I guess, and sausage. But anyway, weather's super nice outside. It's definitely no powder day, but it's supposed to be like 50 something degrees out today. So definitely spring skiing conditions, probably gonna be a bit of slush, but overall it's gonna be great to not have to bundle up or anything like that. So excited to get out there, so let's go.
just finished up skiing at Squaw and it was definitely awesome. Definitely spring skiing conditions, kind of slushy, icy in the morning, slushy in the afternoon. Um, but it was still really, really good skiing, really good terrain, really very, very diverse terrain. Um, it's a big mountain. We got lost a couple of times, but, uh, finished up there and now we're going to head to a brewery. Um, actually we're going to take Pyrus for a little walkabout around, uh, around Squaw and then going to head to a brewery and then we're going to head on down the road to Mammoth. Mm -hmm. So it's always fun being able to visit a new brewery in a new town, meet with a new bartender. Uh, it's always such a unique experience from place to place. Uh, but then we went on down the road just a little ways. Uh, Lake Tahoe is just on the other side of Squaw Valley and drove through there, which is absolutely awesome. And we stumbled across this little place called Emerald Bay, Bay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> not Emerald Cove, Emerald Bay. And we are gonna take a little hike get out, stretch the legs out a little bit, let Pyrus run around a little bit. So it should be a good time. Although we would have loved to have stayed at Squaw longer, we needed to head south to catch the snow that was sure to melt as winter was drawing to a close. We were headed to a place that recently got hit with 20 feet of snow and is now experiencing some of the finest spring skiing around, Mammoth Mountain. Thanks for watching. We can't wait to take you on more adventures. You want to travel with us in real life? Click this link up here. You want to subscribe to stay current on all of our van life and adventure travels? Click this link down here. And lastly, if you want to binge watch all of our videos, this link down here. Until next time, we'll see you later. Bye.